for eclavia the uh, the model is pretty much the same uh, one important change is that we never do live we never ever do live we only do offline so uh, we don't have online mixer at all so what we do is we put a cassette in the camera and we record the video of the person but because we are also blessed with a studio which has the online editing facility we always take that cassette also ye bhi hamara hai wo bhi hamara hai type stick so we take that cassette now you'll ask me the question why do you require that cassette that cassette is for the other camera recordings so for example somebody is asking a question now this camera will not record that so i need that video so that is taken by that other camera cassette and also the points at which the online editor has switched between the cameras uh, and the ha uh, and the uh, writing on the um, a paper is also not captured by this camera so these two things are taken from the mixed video the slides which are there because we work in open source we get all the slides from the uh, faculty so the slides are inserted in video as images so uh, we don't require the online editing uh, process to get where the slide is exactly exactly but in times like if he is showing some website or uh, if he is showing some other demonstration or an animation which is uh, then it has to be given to us again and then we can insert it so this is kind of a slightly tedious process because we have to keep a tab on when is what happening kind of thing okay so yeah question the slides given by the faculty you are putting in the editing right so the online editing on that time the moment of mouse and all things are coming yeah, everything is captured capture right but in editing you are direct putting direct the slide the so the motions and the indications or some right. so it is not captured, uh, not captured. Not correct uh, online editing we rely on the expertise of the faculty suppose i am talking about this photo i i am doing this and it is already captured as a video but in our type of editing the editor has to put a arrow here and rotate it here or editor has to put a underline here or put a square box here and flash it or whatever to grab that it is a additional work of the editor to be done and we deliberately wanted to do that because sometimes the slide which are prepared uh, at the time of lecture are having some problems sometimes the fonts are small sometimes they are not up to the mark sometimes the colors are different so we just take that lecture as it is after the slides come to us we again redo the slides if required sometimes the drawings are very uh, done in a very small th small lines thinner lines so they are not able to see it outside we redo the slide and then we again reconstruct that but the pain is there of uh, reanimating the entire sequence and which we do sometimes so that is another uh, one also the output is different for example all you people are giving cds and dvds uh, as output which are video essentially uh, uh, one more output what we are attempting right now is a html based output of the content which will ensure uh, a video in one corner the table of contents of all the slides presented in that lecture below the video and the actual slide also being shown on the right hand side so which is done by a software called microsoft producer which will give you this option it is a very interesting tool fellow citizens of india 59 years back okay so this is the format what is being done after we pro we run this particular video editing through uh, microsoft producer now you, now you will appreciate the fact of only recording the video of the person now you can see here we cannot show the slide in between so that is why we only require the the video of the speaker the slide is here and this slide is converted to html format the advantage is that i can actually this is not an image now i can actually copy from here now so this is html and uh, here is a table of contents on the left so if i if i don't want to see this particular thing i just want to hear about what is the code fee stamp then i can click here and the video will start from this point onwards and uh, you can pay the fee by getting a code fee stamp so of this uh, linearity is user also very important because stamp, we feel that the, you get out the user should be able to go according to their own pace so it is not necessary in, in video cd what happens is we have to go uh, by forwarding rewinding and attempting n number of times to get to the exact point so we thought this was a better idea 
So similarly, you can just go any point. This data and then is able to stop it. this. So this is so this is the Microsoft producer way of doing it. So this was one more additional uh, type of uh, production process. 